Hi, I'm Kate Bach. And I'm Cammie Crawford. And we are here with Sports Illustrated tonight. We are in Miami. We are at the Hard Rock Hollywood. We are going to have so much fun for the launch tonight. Yes, this we is our second launch. So if you see the girls looking amazing, that's exactly what you can expect because it's been a long few days. It's been a long. We have yeah. like a whole weekend together. Tonight is going to be really fun. We're going to ask them all sorts of questions, get to know the girls a little deeper, and check out their looks. Yes, I can't wait to see. I can't wait to see. That's my favorite part. The know, looks are my looks. favorite I love part. The looks. Okay, who's first? Oh my God. Marquita. Please enter to our right. <laughs> you look so good. Hello. And she Hello. smells amazing. I wish we had smell of vision so they could smell true, you. True, true. <laughs> yes. We also don't, in fact, kiss each other's cheeks because we will ruin each other's makeup, right, but we, we do really like each other. We do yeah, we enjoy each, each other. other's presence. Yes. So, we who are we wearing tonight? Oh, wow. Look. She's beauty. Yes, she giving. is a beauty. Very nice. Yes. And the braids. And the braids. We yeah. love. Oh, right. Because it is humid. Love. I know. Great Very choice humid for the weather. Here. It's so humid. Yeah. yeah. This, I feel secure, locked in. Yes. I should be good for a couple more days. Agreed. Yeah. Yep. Yep. How was it? Wherever, where did you shoot? I was in Barbados with Ben Watts. Mm -hmm. Oh, my Tell God. us about Had it. Had you shot with Jen Ben before? I've shot with Ben a ton of times. He so you know how hard you're going to laugh. Oh, my God. <laughs> It's your birthday, it's your birthday. He brings such good energy. He just like brings the entire set to life. Like that man is so much fun to work with. Yeah, and even that. just being in that country, like it's so beautiful. We got yeah. there, I think Rihanna had just left. So it was just like, the she was here, yeah. you know? Yes. yes. Yeah. We went yes. to like her street where she's from, her old house. Like, so cool. it was, was nice. that your kind of adventure day there? Did you do a little tour of her? I had the food day, but I made them. Mm, I had a food day too. I love the, the food, food day. The food day is the best oh, day. Girl, what did you? Oh my god, we started with snow cones with like whiskey on the beach at 8 a.m. I'd take one of those right now. Hell Love. yes, that would be so refreshing right now. <laughs> um, so that's what we started with, and then we went to the another beach and got like fish cuttas, which are fish sandwiches, mm. and a like amazing fish shack that had been there for 70 years. And then we went to a grandmother's house and cooked like home style cooking in her home. So like, cool! A Love. dream come true to like learn from somebody yeah. that yeah really knows what they're doing. And then finished with fine dining. So it was really just an experience. A great day. Yeah. Was that your first time there? Yes. Yes, it was. Well, it seems like you yeah. saw a lot of it in one, one so trip. Much. Yeah. And like, I will happily go back because everyone was so lovely there. It was, yeah, beautiful. Beautiful. Yeah. What are you most excited about for the whole weekend? <gasps> Ooh, I'm excited <laughs> tomorrow night there's like a surprise concert. Yeah, we saw, they haven't we, told us. We saw Sierra last night. Right. That was. Yep everything for me it's like really teenage fun. years brought back and like yeah knew every single word yes yeah we went for it we did right we yeah. did we out. did but they didn't tell us who's performing tomorrow night no, no they like to keep secrets from us i, I like know very secretive I like i'm like yeah, i don't like little surprises, surprises. Yeah. Cool. i want to know right no. <laughs> no. a surprise hater but it's always good it's always good yes always yeah well we can't wait to dance with you tomorrow can't wait to have a lovely night here tonight at Dare <laughs> and see all the girls on the carpet. Yeah. Yeah. Enjoy. Have fun. Thank you so much. Enjoy. Grab Enjoy. a drink. Yeah. We deserve it, y'all. We've been on the plane since 8 a.m. We had a pickup. We started early and we were not feeling 100% mm -hmm. when that started. So <laughs> that's all I'll say. Yeah. That's, that's <laughs> enough. You get it. You get it. All right. We have somebody coming. Do you want her to do her shots first? Like, should oh. we get out of the way? All of ours. We're going to keep it rolling. We're going to keep it rolling. Keep it rolling. And we're rolling with the Hunter Miss. Yeah. McGrady. Woo! Period. Woo! No, the people work, have work. been waiting for you. <laughs> We've been talking about how we do these fake little side there? kisses, but only because of hair and makeup. That's yeah. it. It's like we barely touch. You're going to come on this to, side. I'm going to pull you over yeah. here, darling. <laughs> So there we can we do our little... Hello. Oh, but it's good for your side part, too. <laughs> yeah, no, Thinking about the... Yes. We wanted that. Yes. 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 How are you, beautiful ladies? We are good. So good. We're so excited. good. Very oh excited. How are you feeling? Good. I'm so excited. I'm with all my favorite people. Like, how can you... Also, my mom just side camera. I said, Hunter, put your <gasps> hair in front. She this literally this is that. your mom? I love that your mom came to support who looks like your sister. She's a babe. Yeah. Such a babe. I Turn the camera. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. See her. You look so hey. good. I was like, it's your night. Have fun. Oh, I love that. Yes. Well, as a mom, what is it like mm -hmm. to represent an SI swimsuit for all the mamas out there? Oh my gosh. It's amazing. Like when MJ texted me, she was like, listen, do you want to do this? I know you just had a baby, but I was like, heck yes, I do. Like, I want to represent for moms out there who, yeah. like, 
maybe don't feel their best in their body and be like, wear the damn swimsuit. Yeah. You know what yeah. I mean? Yes. Like, you yeah. look hot, wear it. Right. Own it. Be comfortable. Yeah. Yeah. I love that about this magazine, too, that they give you the choice. Like, if you feel comfortable, whatever yeah. you want to do, we want you to feel beautiful, we want you to feel good, and that's such a special part of this whole thing. Yeah. Absolutely. That's the yeah. most important thing. And then now, with SI teaming up with Freedom Mom, I feel Pretty like that's cool. just... Do you use Freedom Mom products? Do I use what? Freedom Mom products. you know that brand? Um, Freedom Mom saved my life. Ah, <laughs> haven't had children, but I've heard of it because everyone's yes. reaction is this. Hashtag Freedom not Mom. sponsored, but sponsored. No, Freedom Mom literally <laughs> saved my life. I am such a Frida stan. I didn't know she was going to say that. I know. No. Um, like, she is not being paid or held against for, her will. Is Freedom Mom? <laughs> no. <laughs> but you know, uh, they're one of the sponsors uh, now and like we're teamed up with them no, and it has I, to be a big deal. amazing and so iconic and they're like, they really truly changed my whole postpartum experience my breastfeeding experience everything was amazing okay. yeah i'm gonna text you with all my questions when the time comes yeah. and it will come <laughs> well for the people who <laughs> don't know about yeah. it though yeah. can you explain like how freedom mom helped you like how how is that so they experience? have a ton of products so during pregnancy and their um postpartum is i think what they're really known for like they have um wash you know like a perinatal um, wash. That's what I've heard about. Okay. And, and I feel like anybody stitching. could use that. Anyone could, girl. Get yourself yeah. clean up there. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yes. They have like a breastfeeding pillow. They have yeah. stuff for your boobs. They really have everything. Yeah. I feel like what I learned more recently is I know nothing about pregnancy or birth and there's like a whole world that gets it's unleashed. A whole world. I still know nothing. I think I always tell people, I'm like, none of us really know what we're doing together, right? Like, yeah. We're all right. still learning this. Oh, yeah, yeah, yes. yeah. Perfect. <laughs> yeah. Seems There's no be, better yeah, teacher you're than in doing. A good place with that, yeah. right? Yes. Exactly. Okay. Tell us about your shoot. Where did you shoot? We shot in Belize, which was so gorgeous. I've been to like all my bucket list places with SI. We shot in Bali, um, Anguilla, Costa Rica, and then this year Belize. I was like, girl. Yeah. Every time you get that booking, you're like, yes. Like, where yes. am I going? Yeah. 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 Yes. So it was absolutely beautiful, and just to be there with you know, you know, my family was. Incredible. Yeah, so I love nice. that. I feel like it's never a question of am I doing the shoot? It's where is the shoot yeah. going to be? Yes. I'm where <laughs> do I get lucky to go? Where are we going? I'm trying to rally for an Iceland shoot. Oh, my God. Me, too. <gasps> I've been working on that also. Okay. okay. You I heard can't wait it to here. See it. Not first. You heard it here I can't like wait for to the see 50th it. Off, off time. camera, they're saying no. They're, they're writing it down. It's okay. happening. <laughs> Next year. Just watch. <laughs> yeah. Yes. I'm going to mood board it immediately. Yes. <laughs> what are you excited about for the weekend? Um, I think just meeting so many incredible people. Like, I know that there's so many awesome people who are coming out and have, like, DM'd me and um, are excited to meet all the girls and also just kind of hang out. It's my weekend with my mom, and yeah. it'll yes. be fun. Oh, yeah. Mama's night out. Let's go. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. Mom is the secret star of the show tonight. She's so hot. And she's so hot. Yeah, it's I, crazy. You know. We were literally walking <laughs> through and people were like, oh. And I was like, I know. They were like, there's no big deal. and her no big deal. mom. Her mom. I, yeah. love yeah. Uh, I love it. I love it. I love it. She's giving. She's giving. All right. Well, get that woman a cocktail. Yes. Enjoy yourself. Have so much fun. Good to we see can't you. wait to hang. Looking Mwah. stunning. Ooh, okay. Yes. To them? Return. Return. Okay. Return. We're back. Olivia. Can we put her in the middle? I like it yeah. in the middle. Okay. <laughs> I've been told I have to put the microphone very close to your face, so okay. take no offense. I'm just going <laughs> to we'll get it really <laughs> up in your grill, okay? Love it. You Olivia, look welcome. Amazing. <laughs> yeah. Tell us about this look right now. Um, well, honestly, I just felt like I went into <laughs> like, Tell us about it. I wanted to be a little <laughs> sexy. <laughs> Tell us right now. Sexier. And this dress, like the slits only came up to like here. And I was like, rip them. Like yes. literally like open them up. I did not rip them. A little them. DIY? I'm, no. Um, I wish I could do that. But I just kind of like had someone just cut up and just sew it a little bit and make it look pretty. Very nice. Low, low neck. I mean, I don't have the, you know. You look Girl, gorgeous. that's in. It's but too hot for titties right now, guys. <laughs> Let me yeah, take so it from I me. Like, might as well. Like, <laughs> I can shake. I can move. I'm fine. So I was like, might as well. Love it. So, Rookie Rookie, this is your first year doing this whole press tour. What do you think of it so far? It's absolutely insane. I was not expecting, like, any of this. I feel like, I don't know, I was expecting, like, a little bit more chill vibes. Yeah. And it's, like, 
kind of like fashion week in a sense mm. to me. It's like, go, 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 like full, full glam, full glam, full glam. So I think honestly, but just like as a rookie itself is insane. I was sitting on the plane today and you know, everyone's like sleeping, I don't know, watching Netflix. I'm like sitting there just staring at like the plane full of girls and I'm like, why am I here? Like, Girl. this is crazy. I'm like, I think everyone does that though. So you're yeah. not alone. Like everyone's like, is this, am I present or am I watching this from yeah. a seat? Like, I I'm definitely unclear. feel like I'm hovering. Like that's yeah. how it feels. But then I look yeah. at everyone else and I'm like, oh my God, like of course, of, you're saying how, have you seen that thigh? Yeah. Like, of course, of course you would be in it. <laughs> and where did you shoot this year? I shot in beautiful Montenegro. I've been wanting to go there. It looks amazing. It looks it so good. It was so interesting. I like, just did not know what to expect like as a, place and then I get there and it's like this amazing beach and I'm like whoa yeah. whoa mm -hmm. this is beautiful yes what time of year was it because I feel like I saw people in their BTS wearing puffy jackets oh. they True definitely or looked a little cold it was 40 degrees when I was shooting <gasps> and you would not expect that they blurred or blurred my the photoshopping Ooh. was just the goosebumps Fully, fully, because I was like, I was definitely like freezing, and I was like taking the shots in the water, and I looked so graceful and like sexy, but I'm like, guys, I was freezing in that. Shot. You have to think warm thoughts. You yeah. would never know. Yeah. You would oh, never know. I yeah. only knew because of the video. Yeah, I was like, they have coats on. I was like, a puffy jacket, huh? Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> Interesting yeah. choice. Yeah. Necessary choice. Yeah. Fully, fully. Wait, tell us. So I'm a rookie too, obviously. Yeah. That's we're the rookies here. Yes. How did you find out that you were going to be in the magazine? Oh my gosh. So. Insane story. I've always wanted to work with SI and I just thought like maybe in like four or five years, I don't know. Like I thought it was like a long term goal that for me for mine. And then I was on set and my beautiful PR, Haley, calls me and she's like, go in the corner. And like on set, like you can't go on your phone. Like yeah. and she's like, You need to answer this like right now. And I was like, I thought something like really bad happened and I was yeah. like, Well yeah, well, go in the corner. I'd be like, yeah. Oh my god. So, like, go in your corner, like, so are you sitting yourself. down? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and I go and I like I'm like shooting like on location so I'm like in the corner of this field and I'm like sitting there I'm like hey what's up and she's like so basically like SI just confirmed that you're a rookie this year and I was like ah! like screamed I cried I like, fell to the floor I was, like, crying. like makeup done I'm working yeah and I'm like come back. sorry the makeup client. artist we like, apologize I come back really? I'm like there's like black <laughs> running down my eyes and I'm like and they're like what's wrong and I was like I because you can't tell anyone right. I'm like oh like just booked like a really cool job and they're just like what job and I'm like I hate being that girl but I can't tell you yeah I was like, God bless. yeah I got it oh uh, it's like on Instagram when you're like I know you've all been asking I can't tell you right now <laughs> it's like nobody but wants I feel to be like that the reveal girl. is fun too like the yes. secrecy does make the reveal day that much bigger better yeah. yes oh yeah. I agree okay so what are you most excited about for this entire weekend we started in New York now we're in Florida. What are you looking forward to the I think most? I was honestly, because I look up to so many of these like women, I think I was just like honestly excited to like meet them in person yeah. and to kind of like build those memories because I don't know, I'm like with these people and I'm like, do you guys like me? I'm like, we do love you. you. Like me? I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> like, I feel sometimes out of place, but I think just like being with everyone and like everyone being so accepting, I'm like, Love you guys. Thank yeah. You. <laughs> I think honestly for me too, being first year, the most surprising thing was how nice everyone is yeah. like there is not one person where I think I'm like people are surprised sometimes though because they think we all already know each other right and the surprise is that we don't actually really see other people when we're shooting like we weren't on the same location yeah I didn't know about you you didn't know about me yeah. until we show up and then we're all together, we're all together. and we're together. taking pictures and yeah. smiling at each other yeah, yeah. And, like, I hadn't really met anyone I met Brooks before this and then I think that was it, yeah. And yeah. then walking into the first day of school, yeah. new yes. class. Like, I knew of everyone, and I was like, yeah. I think you know me back, but I don't know. Yeah. And it was like, that kind of like, do I introduce myself? Because yeah. I think I know, like, yeah. I know you. Well, I'm like, yeah. I hope you know me back. Girl, everybody knows yeah. you. You have millions of followers. Yeah. No, but like, everyone oh, like, knows you. You're good. <laughs> <laughs> and loves you. You're the cutest. So Thank sweet. You. You. And we're so happy that you're here. Yes. <laughs> so am I. What am I talking about? I'm a rookie too. I'm like, it's gonna we're be great so happy night. to have you. Yeah. <laughs> She's just yes. happy to be present. Yes, we're just happy to be here. Well, thank you so much. Yeah. You look incredible. Enjoy the party. Enjoy the party. Go ham. Yes. It's only go just ham. beginning. Yeah. Wait, are you 21? No. D don't go don't ham. Don't go that ham. Oh, have don't some sushi. Like apple juice. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. We got milk. Yes. Okay, don't go ham. Um, what's another meat? Yeah. Bologna. Go bologna. Yeah. And enjoy. There's lots of water here. <laughs> yeah, lots of water. Yeah. Well, thank you for having me. Yes, thank of you. You look amazing. Have fun. Have a beautiful night. <laughs> oh my God.
Oh my god, I too was 19 once. Um, was the microphone close enough this time? <laughs> <laughs> Just checking. We have another lady now, entering today, the chat. First of all, you can't get in the wait, middle. Get in the middle. You can't just come up in here looking like Black Barbie oh, and yeah. not say and not say anything. Thank you so much. This is custom, Kristen Andren. Ooh, and the shoes. Oh my God! Totally. In the bag. In the bag. It's and the, the full look. <laughs> and the wait, what are the nails? The it continues. Oh, it, it continues. does. It does. Head to toe. She didn't skip a part. So this was the theme. You were giving Black Barbie. Yes. It served. I love the a game. theme. I love coming in with here. a theme. You will not see me here in Florida. Not in pink. Like even what, what it's was a there pink there weekend. Playing? All pink. pink. Yes. She did have a yeah. full pink yeah. sweatsuit on. Too. She came themed. I get it. Yes. I love that. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. How does it feel to be here right now? I feel like for me, it feels like the best out of all three years, just because when I started, it was in the middle of the pandemic, so we didn't get to celebrate right. Yeah. And then last year, we were finally able to all come together, but it just still had the sprinkles of pandemic still, if you know what I mean. Yeah. Um, bad vibes, bad yes. vibes. So this yeah. year, as it being officially- Not the full my, thing. Yes. I get it. Now, as a vet, I feel like this is no barrier, you know? We're all healthy, thank you, Lord. You know, and we're finally able to celebrate, out, and celebrate, yeah, celebrate, see each other. Some of us we've only ever seen each other online because of the pandemic for the yeah. newer models. So yeah. I think this is a beautiful reunion. Yes. Yeah, I love that. I love <laughs> and where that. did you shoot this year? I shot in Barbados. Hey. Had you been there before? No, but the only thing, like many people, we, the only thing we know about Barbados is Rihanna. You know, so did you see her house? True. No, however, <laughs> she was there the weekend before we shot. Was everyone in the town hyped? Because yes. we've heard this, so I feel mm -hmm. like everyone made it very clear that she had been present. She blessed the streets yes. with yeah. her presence. Yes. Mm -hmm. You were gifted with Rihanna. Yes. Yes. Okay. The people are so nice. Like, it's a, just a beautiful place. Amazing. Okay. I, say, I don't know if anyone mentioned it yet. I had to do something extreme. Oh. Yes. What's that? No one knows this. So, the um, number one sport in Barbados is cricket. It's sort of okay. like a baseball-soccer hybrid. Yeah. Um, but we wanted to also do something that was a kicker, so they also had me eat crickets. Oh, wow. Were and they that's crunchy? All. Thank you all so much for coming. <laughs> what? Yeah. Huh? You ate bugs? Were they chocolate-covered? No. Were they straight? Were they alive? Red. No, they were not. Uh, okay. Well, it's a delicacy. But they were still insects yeah. touching, like feeling and looking. Um, but I will say for anyone curious, it is like the texture of extra crispy bacon. But okay, when you that crunch, doesn't sound the worst. It's a bit airy. You know what? I wasn't so curious. So will you go back for more? <laughs> Salty but dirty. It yeah. tastes like dirt. Absolutely not. No, yeah, she's so, off. She's, she's done. done. Never again. I'm a little Finish. upset about this. So the first time we did it. First time? How many times did you do it? Janine forgot to push the record button. Oh, wow. Janine. That is Kinda not, rigid. yeah. So I took it on the chest, you know, or on the chin. And um, I How did many it times twice. did you have to eat the bugs for the, the camera? The first time I did twice. And the second time, just to dig in, I did three. Wow. Three crickets. I mean, three it's an adventure three sport over here. Three crickets for three years in yeah. Yeah. Yes, yeah. yes. Maybe five. Congratulations. So five we reward you. Pricelessly. Yeah. Thank yep. you guys. Yep. But yep. Yep. Woo. My stomach hurts for you, girl. But a lot of people do love them, so no shade if you like eating crickets. Yeah. Never gone there. You can buy them on Amazon, apparently. I won't be. But thank you so much for letting me know yeah. that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the weekend has just begun. Well, what are you most excited for? Um, I think tomorrow night, because it's like a full day, you know, daytime activations, and then, yeah. you know, partying later on with... It's like the full throttle day. Too. So I'm like, I yeah. think yesterday will be like the final hoorah. Who do we think it is, guys? I don't know. Who do we hope it is? I don't know. Yeah. Honestly, Ooh. I would love to see Sierra again because. Yeah, let's bring her back. <laughs> that was amazing. Yeah. Let's yeah. rerun that. Yeah. Another <laughs> one. Another one. Honestly, ooh. I don't know. I mean, Mr. there's so many options. Himself? It's so broad. <laughs> it's so broad. I don't know. Or a pit bull. Yeah. Right. Yes. Pit bull would be appropriate. That would actually be genius. Oh, yeah. Yep. Put me on the team, SI. There you go. In a, okay, in we a put different that capacity. Out there. Yeah. I'll, plan, I'll plan it. We're well, just planning the future. Exactly. Well, thank you for gracing us with this. Yeah. I mean, I can't wait for your next pink look every day. Yes. Pink. Well, actually, tomorrow morning. 
Perfect. We'll be awaiting it. We'll be awaiting it. Thank I you. love it. That was right. lovely with Tanae. We learned more about Barbados. Yes. Seems like everyone really loved that location. And now we have our cover girl. Cover girl. <laughs> Yumi. Hello. Hi. A Hi. doll. How are you? Right in the middle. Yep. Because you are the star of the show. Yeah. Our cover girl. <laughs> First of all, we started modeling together. We were talking about it. You did? <laughs> we modeled for Coles together. Do you have a e picture of you at like 12 years old oh, together? No, no, no. no, there are no, there are no photos of those moments. Someone yeah, Google it and find them. Started. Someone we've find the photos. Yeah. We're a long yeah. way from modeling like uh, pajama sets. What is it Very like to be here now as the cover star? I mean. How would you, how would anyone describe me in cover star? I literally, like, I'm, I'm struggling to explain the feeling because it's something I would have never dreamed of, you know? And so yeah. I'm just trying to soak up every single moment that I can, and, yeah. and I'm so grateful. Yeah. You look how fire. did you get your surprise? Because I feel like that's one of my favorite parts of cover reveal it moments. I think that everyone needs to know. No one knows ahead of time. It's never right. a guarantee. You don't know what's happening, and you don't necessarily expect it. It's not even like while you're shooting, they're telling you, like, this is it. Like, yeah. just so you know. Like, you have no idea what's going on. So whenever they surprise you, it's truly a surprise. Yeah. I think I actually watched yours. Like, you I were... Very confused. I blacked yeah. out. I was... Ah! I blacked out. Were you with your... Your boyfriend or yeah. your, your yeah. fiance? Oh yeah, my yeah God. he was part of it. Oh my gosh, I remember that. And I remember feeling like that feeling. I like didn't know. I feel like I, I, I faded out into like, I stopped speaking and he was like, no, 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 we're happy. And I was like, ah. so You're like, I am, I am. <laughs> no, I'm happy. I just have no words. Like, it's like a shock that yeah. goes over your whole body and you're just like, because then you're, you're processing the surprise first. Mm -hmm. Like, I thought this was for something else and now it's for this. Yeah. And then you're like, oh my God. This like it's happening. This is what it means, and, yeah. and you're kind of taking it all in while the team is in front of you, and they're like, Come and they're all watching you, and they're freaking out, yeah. and you're freaking right. out, and everyone's I don't know. Uh, yeah. I feel like it's almost like watching a baby take their first steps. Totally. <laughs> the mom and the, like everybody's looking at the child like totally, ah! and you're the baby's like, what? What's actually happening? That's so. Did you have exciting. any feelings while you were shooting that you're like? I love this vibe. I'm just feeling it. Everyone, you know, like the light is hitting yeah. right. It's golden hour. I'm having a moment. Mm -hmm. Like sometimes you can tell like, yeah. not that it's a cover, but that you're like, yeah, everything's think, falling into yeah. place. I was like trying to see the monitor because I was doing an interview. I was trying to see the monitor to see myself because I was like, how do I look, you know? Yeah. And it was, it like doesn't, didn't show up. So I'm like, I wonder where they have a monitor. Just like not clicking. Yeah. And like in the middle of the interview, I'm like, why? What is I was just like, what is this? Like, why am I? <laughs> <laughs> What's why going on here? here? What's going on? Like, it wasn't clicking. Yeah. Um, and so I was like, and then when they asked me a question about Sports Illustrated, I was like, and then I started to panic and I'm like, wait, wait. And then Could this be up, it? Yeah. I was like, it was it. Uh. Yeah. So it kind of, I was like questioning and then I had the aha moment. Yeah. Incredible. Then, oh, yeah. I have like chills in front, but it's oh. just like. I it's love so that. fun. I wish I could like bottle that feeling up, like yeah. and just keep it and like review it, go back to it yeah. whenever I Sell want. Because I, I was like jumping <laughs> off wall. Like I was just like, I, I can't stop. I can't, like let's take photos and do interviews. I'm like I can't even speak right now. Oh. Yeah, it's oh. a lot, but I'm so happy for you in yes. such a moment, and you just want to soak it all up and just like live in it as long as you can. You deserve, girl, truly. And in addition to being an incredible model. Yes. Many people might not know that you are also an incredible artist, musician. Mm -hmm. And you dropped a song today? I dropped a project today. A whole project. Wow. So buy it, stream it, all the things. Yeah. Tell us Play about it. how, just the difference between modeling and music. Like, how do you combine yeah. the two? What are the differences? Yeah. Where do you feel the most at home? Mm. I feel at home in both in different ways. Like, music is a personal, creative vessel for me where I can say things in a more personal, vulnerable light. And modeling, I feel, is more collaborative. Not that music isn't, but it's like, music is more of like a personal representation where yeah. like I'm working with a team to reflect their vision and I'm like being a part of a bigger picture. Whereas like music is my own picture. It's I like guess. a raw version of yourself. Yeah. Like you're putting it all out there yeah. while modeling your character. You yeah. can be someone else for a day. Yeah. 
Yeah, I got that. The music is great, y'all, and I'm not just saying that. I actually <laughs> have downloaded it, so. There Stream. We go. What's the song? What's the project? It's called Hajime. Hajime. You heard it here me. first, or probably not. Stream that right second. now. <laughs> After this. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Congratulations. Yeah. We're so happy for you. Oh, tell us about the fit. Oh, yeah. What are we wearing? Um, for Love and Lemons dress, Jacques Mousse heels. So cute. And, um, yeah, I think that's it. Mm. And then I got my nails done by Serena. Oh, yeah. You were talking about these on the plane. These, you guys should do a close-up. This oh, is a situation literal drip. right here. Do you literal see Literal drip. Texture. Fire. It's wild. Incredible. Water droplets. Yes. So, yeah. and it goes with like the theme like, of yeah, my dew drops. Yeah. Yeah. Dew drops. Yeah. yeah, very cool. And the hair, Ooh. girl, it's giving. Well, we don't want to hold giving. our cover girl from celebrating her yes. moment, her yes. weekend, her week. But go we will happily people, speak girl. to you whenever we're, you're available out there. Yes, <laughs> go make your rounds. Okay. Enjoy. Mwah. <laughs> oh, she's so the sweetest, cute. sweetest so human. So happy so she's cute. representing <gasps> us this year. First of all, oh, a babe. Oh, hello. Welcome. Miss Kristen. Girl. We all like a cutout, apparently. We're very aligned. We yeah. don't like to show skin here at SI Swim. We keep it yeah. very covered up. <laughs> Tell us PG. about the look. Yes. Oh, my gosh. Well, tonight we are wearing just this lovely little dress with this cutout. And the best part about it is it is just so comfortable. True. We love comfort True. first. True. We do. It's we like, love to be able to bend. Is, is this comfortable? No. And let me tell you something. One wrong move, <laughs> yeah, and it's she, all coming off. Yeah, yeah. you got to be careful in that one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Say, no Ciara oh, no, moves be, in that. Yeah. No Ciara moves. Can't be doing what I did yeah. last night tonight. She's just toe-tapping it the whole <laughs> night. I love that. This is it. I love that. Oh, my God. Okay, where did you shoot this year? I was in Barbados, which was amazing. I had mm -hmm. never been there. Have you guys been to Barbados? Yeah. I have, yeah. Yeah. Beautiful. Amazing. Yeah. The people are so beautiful and nice and amazing, and the food was really good. I loved it. I loved it. And so was that Rihanna your first from? time with Ben Watts? Yes. I'm obsessed with him. He's incredible. And the whole day we were just like vibing, and we just had the best day. Like one shot, I'm like drinking a beer, sitting on a bench. It was so chill. And Love so it. He makes you work so real cool fun. Also, real fun. <laughs> so good. Yeah. But I didn't realize until you posted that you are a rookie this year. Yeah. She's my no search winner. Idea because when I first met you, I was like, "She's so hot. She's got to be in the magazine <laughs> every single There's year." There's no way this is new. I'm so glad <laughs> that they found you because you are actually. Can we learn about that? How was the model search process? Like, how did you first enter? What was it like? Because I think it changes a little bit every year, so it's always a new story. Well, so for my year, it was kind of during COVID, so it was a little bit different. They started the video submissions, which was really amazing because women all over, got to yeah. submit videos. You didn't have to be there in person, it was... That was the first time that that happened, and I think they ended up keeping that because it was so nice to just have access to so many women, and um, so I submitted my video. I was a little unsure. Me and Katie were talking about that today. Like, I almost didn't press send. Okay, did it have a theme? Like, what, like when you're submitting a video, what what is your yeah. storyline? I don't know. I really tried to, like, get my essence across which is kind of hard to do but i yeah. tried to just be myself and have fun with it yep. and it turned out great and then yeah i got the call and then we did a shoot last year and then they i got picked as a rookie and here Girl. i am I and here we are like, looking what like can a happen vet in the air is so crazy <laughs> crazy in this world and we uh, always have so many events and shoots and like there's so many things throughout the year we really get to spend a lot of time together and it's so much fun being part of this family. Oh, yeah. Amazing. I feel so lucky and like just getting to know all of you guys. You are all so amazing. Yeah. The women here are just incredible. Yeah. Truly the nicest people. But I, yeah. we were saying when we were getting on the plane earlier, everyone was like, summer camp, we're going to summer camp because that's yeah. what it feels like. It does. Yeah. Just getting this many women together is like summer camp. Exactly. And so again, fun. not that many of us knew each other ahead of time because there was a lot of new girls, a lot of turnover. So it is like summer camp where you're meeting everyone and you're like, right. hi, like what's Hi. your name? Like, where are you from? <laughs> what do you like? What's your favorite color? What's your sign? Yeah. What is your yeah. sign? Oh. I'm a Gemini. My birthday is coming up. Ooh. What are you guys? Scorpio, of course. Oh. Naturally. Oh, yes. He said, oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, well, I'm Gemini. Damn. Oh, everybody's I like we're like the outcasts of the Zodiac. Everyone's like, eh. Ah. But when's good, your birthday? Next week, May 28th. Oh, yeah. coming right up. Coming we right got up. any plans? I'm, I'm going to go to the Hamptons. Love it. Yes. Oh, love that. Love that spot. Great and spot. And this is like the pre-celebration. This is the pre-celebration. Yeah. It up. This love is it. actually Kristen's birthday party. So welcome. Yes, welcome. Welcome to, my birthday. Thank welcome you. to Kristen's birthday. <laughs> Being live streamed for all the people to see. Okay, we got our next girl coming on the carpet. So we got to release you. 
good. Thank you. Oh, the great. looks. The looks are giving. This is so fun. It's so, so easy. Fun. Everyone's so great. So easy. And Hi. Geo is here. First Welcome. of all, Geo. Yes. You have to show this ponytail. I know. Because we, when you walk you in. Door, do you see this leather moment? Ooh. Like, I feel like she's giving. fun to dance with. Yeah. She's it's giving dominatrix. a little bit. Yeah. You got to be careful who's near you. I'm in love. No, we all need a few drinks. Yes. So what did you, <laughs> what are you wearing tonight? I'm wearing an Australian designer, Christopher love. Esber. I hope that's ah. how you say it. Yes. I think that's who you're wearing yep. as well. Okay. Same, Stop. same. We're very aligned. I do love the Australian designers. I have to say, for all these red carpet events and looks, Australians Absolutely. just get it. It's Australian. Bronx is and Zanko. It? it is Australian. Yeah. Okay, Australia, so shout Aussie out. Love. There we go. Yeah. Did this for you. And they're making it for us eyes too. Yeah. Even yep. more important. Yep. Right? Yep. Okay, no. where did you shoot this year? Barbados. Everybody went to Barbados. I, I feel like I missed out. I feel out. like this is like a Barbados party. Like I everyone love loves Barbados. I love it. Incredible. And you're a rookie this year like me. I am. Tell me about the rookie shoot. Were you yeah. as nervous as I was? I honestly didn't. I felt like I was there. I found out 24 hours before I had to go. So that was no way. Okay, I feel like we get so many questions of how did you prep. I'm like, we don't always know that much ahead. Sometimes I've had hours, time, sometimes not at all. Professional models like right. for everyday jobs, so yeah. I feel like we're always ready and ready to go. Well, maybe it's like a mental, like you're just like, oh my god, I'm freaking out. This is a big moment. Am I like exactly. mentally prepared? Yes. But I think I was ready, and I didn't get time to think about it, so it kind True. of all just happened organically. And True. obviously, MJ and Margo were there cheering me on, and. They don't give you an opportunity to get in your head, so no. I was ready for it. I know. People always ask also, like, are you comfortable shooting in a bathing suit? I'm like, if you got in a bathing suit and had 10 people around you telling you you're killing it and you're yeah. amazing. Telling and, you like, how hot no you are. Been you're better. You're incredible. You, drenching you literally. in oil. Like, MJ scream, oh yes. Yeah, they're like, yes. there's one hair. Let me just get it. Like, you would probably feel good if you had that Absolutely. kind of support system around you, which we're very lucky to get. A thousand percent. Yeah, so true. An incredible experience. I love that. I love that. And so I this is your first launch also. Yeah. Is this what you expected? Like, have you done? I remember my first time I was like, there's microphones and cameras and lights. And this is very different than what I've ever done. My agent prepped me, but I was like, maybe I shouldn't have drank so much last night. Oh, I, I, we, we all had a rough flight. It's fine. Well. It was a, it was a moment. Yeah. This morning, you guys, it was, we it, were not at our best early. Yeah. We were not at our we best. Slept the whole way. Okay, we had a lot of turbulence, and I was dead asleep, yeah. not yes. affected by travel. Nope. It was a little scary at times. It was, but it was part of my dream. I think it just like incorporated into my sleep, and like it was rocking her to sleep. Yeah. yeah, she was on a boat in her dream. She was on a yacht. I love that. Um, well, I feel like I don't know. I only had two weeks to prepare for my shoot, and I was stressing. Yeah, Girl, but first of all, thank God they were already there. Thank God. <laughs> but what do you do to prepare? You know, what do you do to prepare just for life as a model working? I honestly think the most important part as being a model is your mental health. Yeah. And I've spent the last three years working so extensively at that. Um, I think it's so important to surround yourself with such incredible people. Yeah. I wasn't doing that for the longest time. Yeah. And now I have the best agent in the world. I feel that's also like grounding me, pushing me forward and making my dreams a reality. For sure. I think having an agent that understands you is so, so essential. Yes. And that you can be completely honest with. If you're not feeling good, if you're having a hard day, Absolutely. whatever's going on, if you can be honest with them, yeah. everyone's going to benefit. And I feel like I'm finally at a point in my career where people aren't telling me what size I need to be. Yeah. And I'm kind of getting booked for who I am. And yeah. it's, do you know how liberating that feels? Yeah. Like, it's a game changer for me. And I think my yeah. whole mental state around that just like, yeah. Yeah. Like, it doesn't matter. We just want you. This is just the beginning. Yeah. 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 I love that. I love yeah. that. Because mental health is the most important thing in anything that you do in life. So, yeah. And it's Mental Health Awareness Month. So yeah. perfect time yeah. to focus on it. Absolutely. And you guys are going to be talking about it tomorrow. Yeah, right? I know. We I'm have excited. a panel. Yeah. The panel. Have a panel tomorrow? We have a bunch of different panels. And we Surprise. might be on different ones. But I know I'm speaking on the mental health one, which yeah. I think is really important. I also think in our industry, you know, there are a lot of challenges. We're alone a lot of the time. And you're put in crazy situations. And yeah. I just think having a really solid, like, group of people around you that you can call or text or email or whatever makes a million times different. I came to America when I was 21 chasing a dream. I didn't even know what I, what I yeah. wanted. And I was having agents being like, gain weight. The more weight you are, the more money you're going to make, which yeah. I'm sure you've seen oh, yeah. and experienced as well. It's very confusing. That's I feel like our industry, you're money. never big enough or no. small enough. Right. You're like in the middle, which yeah. is most of America. Absolutely. Yeah. Is 
not a size they want, which no. I don't know. But now I feel like it's coming to fruition. It's changing. Good. I think this edition of SI especially showed that. Yeah. It was such a variety of models, ethnicities, ages. Like, yeah. you can't get better. Like, yeah. I really feel no, like we're really lucky, it. for sure. Yeah. Thank you for gracing us yeah. with your beautiful yeah. presence. I, oh, I sorry. Like, Should we go on one side? I know. We do not like it at all. <laughs> What do you guys like? Leave a comment. I don't know if you can. Yeah. You can tell us if we should switch. You're but killing it. You're a killing pleasure. it. Pleasure. Enjoy your night. So Celebrate. Much. Appreciate like, you guys. Yeah. Such a treat. Enjoy <laughs> that ponytail. I know that pony is really Woo! doing it. Here she comes. Something. The dancing queen. In the middle giving the anyone dancing tennis. Queen. Head. Or okay. Miss girl. Hello. Hey, Miss girl. Hi, how Katie. Are you? How are you? I, I'm doing great. This is so fun. I love how you guys are both hosting. This is so. I know. Cute. Are I mean, we giving tennis edge? Yeah, can't are, tell. That, like, are you like Geo said we were around? giving tennis. And what's tennis? We're, we're like, like you go oh, back and forth. Back and forth. Back yeah. And forth. Let How us do you know. feel? We can really? switch. Yeah. Let us know if you feel uncomfortable you in our presence. Like yeah. <laughs> I love to be the center of attention, baby. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Meant okay. to be. Katie is a rookie this year too, like me. Yep. How does it feel? I mean, I feel like I keep saying this over and over, but it's still so crazy. It's still so surreal. And I mean, like, I feel like I went through. An entire almost two year process to get here too, which feels like very rewarding to be here like right now yeah. and just being like, Oh my gosh, this is it. You did it, you're a rookie baby, and it's just crazy. I feel like yeah. when I even when I opened that magazine for the first time, I was like, Oh my god, I shot there. I know it's real, but like when you open it, that's yeah. when it really hits you for the first time. So that was literally like what, yesterday? Yeah. yeah. So that was the craziest part. I actually honestly I wanna ask you a question. What would bite? <laughs> She's turning it back. Your ten, ten years, <laughs> ten years of Kate Buck. What would you give yes. rookies advice? Like Tell us. Ten years ago, if you were in our shoes, like how crazy that to think about that you were once a rookie ten years ago. It is weird. It is very weird. I feel like I have a disconnect sometimes. Like I still am a fan of the magazine. I like looking through the magazine, and you're like, oh yeah, that's me. But like I was there, so like I don't, I don't like see myself as in it in the yeah. same way. I don't know. I have like a disconnect. But I think, I mean, they make fun of me, but I feel like, honestly, being early, showing up on time, like, yeah. being nice, mm -hmm. being a good person, like, those are things that will keep you around, always. Totally like, yeah. just kind people of respecting you. Yeah. Totally check, agree. check, check, check. Early, I'm working on. Yeah. Um, yeah. But <laughs> the rest of them. Get back to you about that yeah. one. <laughs> yeah. Your shoot was in... Montenegro. Montenegro. Oh, oh my that God. looked so beautiful. And you know what? I mean, obviously the shoot day was absolutely incredible. James is amazing. The whole team is amazing. They make you feel your absolute best self. But my activity day was oh. literally, I don't know how I got so lucky. My activity day was drinking and eating my way through Montenegro. And it was Struggle like, bus for you. Yeah, I was like, Poor girl. really hard work. Damn. Really tough, hard job. I'm like, this isn't work. This is amazing. I'm just drinking and eating amazing food at the best locations yeah. ever. So it was great. I know. They really put us through it. It's yeah. hard. It's a it's hard It's really, really difficult. It's really difficult to be pretty and eating constantly. <laughs> Wait, okay. So what was the food like in Montenegro? What did you eat? What was yeah, your favorite what thing? Is cultural it was really there. different. It was yeah. really different. But um, I'm going to like literally butcher the names of it. But basically, it's like a... Uh, a pastry-esque type of dumpling, not a dumpling, but like a pastry type flaky yeah. bread with like different types of cheeses and spinach in the middle. And then oh. you chug it afterwards, you take a bite and you chug with milk afterwards. So like, I'm not Very like the different. biggest fan of like, they like literally have jugs of milk. And you know, in LA we're like, oat milk please, yeah. almond milk please. Yeah. And so for the right. camera I'm like, Mmm, I love milk. <laughs> but it was really good food. It was really good. Wow, yeah. very cool. lovely. I feel like I can try anything once. Yes, I agree. And the coolest part yeah. about it is I'm actually from Croatia. My mom is. Oh, and cool. I don't know if you, a lot of people didn't know. I didn't know. Montenegro is about a 30, 40 minute flight ride from Croatia. So it felt okay. very close to home. And like I got to experience a lot of like the dishes that my mom grew up with, which is really cool. Very cool. Yeah. yeah. It's just so beautiful there. That's somewhere really yeah. on my bucket list I want to go. So I'm so jealous you got to see it. Yeah. I'm asking you questions. I don't, you want I'm like, I, I want to know. Somebody's <laughs> interviewed Kate about all her 10 years. What was your favorite place to shoot at? Favorite place to shoot. I don't know. I think it depends a lot about like the weather, the location, yeah. like mm. if it was humid, if it was like all the other elements that kind of come into it too. But maybe Bali because it was like my special Ooh. year. Yeah. yeah. Love. Yeah. Love. Spot too. Yeah. yeah. We're, we'll go there next year. Yeah. <laughs> we'll be back right? some more. Guys, anyone? Tickets to Bali next year? We're coming back, right? 
This isn't. Yeah. This isn't we our first time. Last time. Now yeah. For that too. Oh my god. Let's do it. Great. Tell us first of all, if you don't know Katie, she's the most sunshiny person ever, and the yellow. Yeah. Hence the yellow. Outfit the yellow it. is like the perfect look. Well, okay. So I actually like I saw this online and I thought it kind of reminded me of like a more 2022 version of How to Lose a Guy in 10 Days Yellow. Oh, and like, with a course great reference. Yeah. So that's why I liked it because I'm obsessed with that movie and Kate. And um, yeah. yeah, that's where, that's the inspo. Love that. A little that. bit more SI swimsuit, yeah. jazz vibed up. So that's the vibe for nice. tonight. Nice. It's giving. Beautiful. It's giving what it was supposed to have been gave. Beautiful. You understood the assignment and I love that. <laughs> well. I love a reference. Looks Enjoy like we have this party. A lady yeah. running up. We have on I deck. Just say, oh, this is an intro to Camille. Camille Ooh. is one of the reasons I did it Here again, baby. To Camille is one of the reasons I tried out for Swim Search again. There you go. So she's up next. Our other dancing queen. <laughs> Thank you so much, Katie. Oh yeah, duo. dancing queen. There you go. Young and sweet. I mean, she young. did. She came ready to dance Girl. too. The ponies have been good. The twizzly. <laughs> what do you call Look this? At this. Be beading. Fringy. fringy beads. Yeah, fringy beads. Fringy beads bringing up. I, yep. went, I went a little, um, I feel like you'd appreciate this, Kate, because I feel like we find a lot of info in our truth, but like yep. a little Casino Sharon Stone uh -oh. moment. I love that reference. A little yep. bump, bump, a little go-go boots, and yep. a little fringy. Yep. Love that. I tried. I tried. <laughs> you, you succeeded. I love this a is theme. fire. I do love a theme. Yes. This is so, Cammie, you know, it's so relaxing to be on this side and not oh. be the interviewer. I am yeah. interviewing now. I, yeah, girl. <laughs> she is present. Yeah, I am. Unfortunately, I am working. No, this is great because this is what we do. This is yeah. this is what we do. But isn't it fun? Your worlds collide. You're 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 learning as a rookie. Yeah. You step into the spot. Yes, you're a model, but MJ wants to know what are you passionate about? What do you like to do in life? Like yep. do it all. And um, here you are. And utilizing those skills because you hosted the red carpet in New York last night. Yes. Yep. How was it? It was. Major, it was almost two hours of just live, and you yep. don't know the order of the people. Yeah. No, nope. you're mic'd up the whole time, so you can't ask questions. Right, good thing I remembered all the models' names. Yeah, and Solid. Um, good work. I had a fangirl moment with Sierra, and I literally, like, full blown movie scene fangirl moment, couldn't remember my name, couldn't remember how to talk. Yeah, yeah, so you talked to, to the Sierra, Sierra on good, the carpet, good. on yeah. the carpet, and on stage because you were still fangirling at the end of the night when we were on stage with her. I thought I was gonna. Pass She's like, I will never not fan girl. Actually, I was screaming my middle school self that was like grinding with boys to like my goodies. Yeah, yeah. Oh lord! That she was screaming the front row. We could touch her. We went on stage. Wow. We already started a campaign to bring her back to perform tonight. So yeah. we're seeing what we can do there. We're working, we're working on, on it. it. Yeah. 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 Are you watching? We yeah. brought it. We brought it. Camille is your biggest fan. Biggest biggest fan. I really am. So I where really did you shoot this year? I shot in the Virgin Islands, specifically in St. Croix, which is was. Really Had you been there before? Yes. Because so, your family is from there. Yes, I have a grandmother who lived in St. Croix, so every place we went on adventure days or for shoots, I was like, I've been here. I've been a carnival here. I've had food here, so it was really special. And in St. Thomas, when I was 15, I did. It was probably my worst shoot ever because I wasn't a pro. Oh, but I, great memory. Yeah. I pretended to be a Sports Illustrated swimsuit model, so it was like, wow, oh, the real deal this time. Oh, <laughs> love that, love that. Well, we That's shot in St. Croix together. Yes. Did you have a food day? Or what was no. your adventure? Your yeah, activity? Your adventure? Oh. It was quite the activity. I went parasailing. Oh, that look! I actually saw some footage. That I've been wanting to do it. Is it? Was it worth it? Would you do it again? It was worth it. It scared me. It did? Yeah. But it's a slow, like you go up kind of slowly, That's right? That's what Janine told me. And oh, wow. Well. <laughs> I just broke up in the yeah. air. Um, and then I went jet skiing, and then I went on the stilts, and I was a Moko oh. Jumbi. I How was your thing. balance out there? Awesome. Don't watch, actually watch the video for a laugh, but don't yeah. watch it. It could be on Comedy, Comedy <laughs> Central is. SI. We're going to erase the footage. Anything for SI. I'll do it all. Yeah. <laughs> She's ready. Oh my god, so what are you most excited for this weekend? We're in Miami, we're in Hollywood, truly. Yeah. We're at the Hard Rock. What do you look forward to when you come to these weekends? I mean, I think we were all so excited. We love the New York moment, but coming here, it's warm weather, a lot of rain today, but it's all right, we're gonna bring the sunshine. Um, yes. There's the meet and greets, getting to meet the fans, the followers, the people that keep this brand alive and, and keep us excited and motivated about what we do. Um, we, we, we do this because we love it and it's, it's something inside of us that lights on fire but we also do it because I was that girl on the other side that looked up to women yeah. like ourselves and it's, mm. I think it's still sh surprising I 
maybe I'm just speaking for myself, but it still hasn't settled that I am that person that I've admired yeah. from afar of you and Ashley Graham and Tegan and, and McPherson, and it's just kind of wild to be like, yeah. we're here. Like, wait, is that me? Is, it, yeah. is that? Yeah. yeah. It gets confusing. <laughs> I know. I got it. So oh. We love all of you that are tuning in and watching. Um, you really motivate and inspire us to be better and be the best versions of ourselves and continue to put ourselves out there. And I just want to say, let go of your fears, any limitations, go for it because that's how we all got here. Yes. And we're having a lot of fun. We're living life. Yes. We're just living, we're just life. living life. We're just living life. <laughs> yes. I love it. Doing the most. I love it. Live. Yes. <laughs> All well. right, we got Cindy Wolfie lined up and ready to go coming oh my on God. the carpet. Big night, thank you, Camille. Of course, night. anytime, you, babe. You look incredible. Hopefully, we could get some water up here in a second, guys. Uh, I see them. <laughs> They're all behind water. us. I see I a lot of colors. I see, I see, I see a see lot a of looks. There's a lot going on. And I'm ready. There's a lot going on. But we Hello. have the Miss Welcome. Cindy. Welcome. Girl. Come on in. How are you guys? You look so hot. First of all, nice to meet you also. Yep, yep. <laughs> like, I'm Cammie. How are you? So good. How are you? You look beautiful. You guys look, you. look so good. You I was watching too. you guys from out there being like, wow, they look amazing. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, so tell us, you're a rookie this year too. Yes. Yeah. How was your shoot? Where was your shoot? Tell us all about it. Yeah. My shoot was in Barbados, which was the most exciting thing because I'm a huge Rihanna fan, so I literally cannot stop talking about it they literally took me to her house because they were like this girl's oh crazy <laughs> is it like is there a sign like rihanna's I house know. does How do everyone you know, know? The, street, the street is called rihanna drive wow. with her with her house Goals. on that like, street yeah. gateway one day one day <laughs> yeah i don't know if i want everyone I mean, knowing where i live cool. yeah but she lives on the street with her name no she doesn't live there anymore oh. apparently oh, she tried to buy the house up. but she like she doesn't even own him yeah. Oh. On her own street. I'll be damned. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be right. like, I own this yeah. whole place. Right. I own this right. whole block. It's your street. Oh, my God. Okay. So cool. So who did you shoot with this year? I shot with Ben Watts. Had you met him before? No, but I had been a fan of his work because I've been following, like, Sports Illustrated since I was so young. And he used to always shoot Barbara Palvin, and I yeah. was, like, a huge Barbara Palvin fan. Yeah. Um, so I've definitely like known of him for a long time. I was very, very excited to shoot with him. He's the most fun. I think that's a blessing like to yeah, get. I just had so much fun. He made me feel so comfortable. It was really, really fun. Cool. So you've been a fan of the brand. You've watched, you've seen the magazine. Is this all what you thought it was going to be? Like the, the launch, the parties, the girls, the events, it's a lot. I mean, yeah. I, I think, yeah, I, I guess I didn't really have an idea of what it was really going to be like. I think. Even the shoot alone already um, exceeded. Yeah, exceeded yeah. my expectations for sure. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. So cool. Tell us what it was like to find out that you were going to be a rookie. How did you find out? Oh. Um, I got called by my agent. I actually had a feeling because they were recording. I was like, why are they recording this? <laughs> like a Zoom? Yeah. Ah. It was during the pandemic. So, And I mean, I had been interviewed like some previous years so I like didn't want to get my hopes up or anything um, so I was just like having zero expectations so I wouldn't be disappointed but it was a pretty it was a pretty hard year for me because I got locked out of the country and I was like just you like did? yeah and I got broken up with and then like and then I got Sports Illustrated and I was like okay yeah. silver lining silver lining the best revenge after a breakup speaking from experience also yeah, because chill. I also went through a breakup before my shoot is being in Sports okay, Illustrated. They regret it all. Don't you worry. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> has, he tried to, has, they, has they tried to contact you since the issue came out? 1,000%. Yeah. She's like, don't get me started. <laughs> happened. Okay. Because mine did. Yeah. Just for the record. <laughs> and don't they all come back, though? They come yes. Back. They always come back. Yes. Yeah. Oh, my God. So do you know what to expect this weekend? Do you have anything you're looking forward to in particular? Or is it all just like a fresh new ride that you got to see what happens? I'm just excited for everything. Like this is super exciting. Everything about it is super exciting. And I get to do it with friends. So I'm like super excited about everything. Love we it. are too. Love it. Well, enjoy the festivities. Have, have an amazing so time. Fun. We're so happy to have you. Yes. Can't wait to see you. <laughs> Thank yes. You. Come on, Pink. Pink is a theme. No, pink is really pink a theme. Pink and the white are themes. I don't have a pink look, and now I feel like we could oh, we have need a pink had, look. Like, the whole thing happening. We need a pink oh, look. Oh, Natalina. Natalie. Hello. You look, look at so you. How chic. Do a little spin. What's the back? It's giving, oh, like, Margot oh. Robbie. Of course. Hot. 
Love beauty. It. Love it. What was the inspiration? Um, well, I found this myself, and I was like, this is cute. And the hair was more of like a Pamela, Pamela yeah. Anderson vibe. Pamela is really trending. She's come back yeah. with a force. Yeah. I love it. Yeah. It's very good. <laughs> what was it like being back in the magazine again this year, right? This is your second year? Yeah. It was um, pretty crazy. I like was not expecting anything, and they called me back, and they're like, hey, you're coming to Belize. Last year I was here, and you know we stayed at this hotel, actually. We shot in Miami. Mm-hmm. And um, totally different. Jungle, rivers, bridges. Yep. Yeah, we were back to back, so we yeah, saw yeah. each other. Yeah. Yeah, so but it was different, but it was really awesome. How did Love they it. tell you that you were coming back? Because I feel like people assume that we always know, but you really don't know if you're ever going to yeah. be asked back. And, like, there isn't a date that you'll know by. Like, right. it's just, like, one day someone calls you, maybe, hopefully. <laughs> like, like, you want to come know. back? Fingers crossed. Yeah. Um, I just, you know, I got a phone call being like, hey, would you want to come back? Like, completely yeah. out of the blue, random. Yeah. And um, I was waiting for it with my fingers crossed, and it happened. So, so yeah. yeah, so exciting. So I remember when we were shooting, you had like a crazy adventure day, and I learned something new about you. Soccer is in your life, your history, and you played soccer. I played soccer. I started playing probably when I was like four years old, competitively, and then um, I got to play with the women's national team in Belize, which was really, really cool. Um, and yeah, and I played in college. It's like my whole family played like soccer. Were you nervous going back? Um, I don't know. The girls, like, we had a lot of fun. We did, like, a little scrimmage, and I tried to, like, bring out what's remaining of my soccer moves, and it was so fun. I haven't, like, kicked around a soccer ball in so long, so, yeah. I grew up playing soccer, too, and I feel like it's one of those sports you're so in it, and then once you're not on a team, it's not an easy sport to just pick up on a Tuesday. I don't think I could do it. I don't think I have the coordination to do it. No. That's a, that's a skill. Fun. Yeah. A serious skill. Yes. Yeah. yeah. What are you excited about most for the weekend? Honestly, I just like have so much fun hanging out and seeing everybody. Everyone like dresses up so beautifully, makeup, yeah. hair, everything is on point. Mm-hmm. And we all get to be together and hang out. Yeah. And it's yeah. like such a rare thing that we're all together. So. I know. Yeah. It is fun that it's a whole weekend and we get to like it. It's like summer camp the first day and then we all like get into it a little bit, yeah. like more comfortable. It's really fun. Yeah. yeah. Super fun. Yeah. <laughs> have an amazing time. Yeah. I know there's so much to expect for the weekend, but we can't wait to see you looking like this. I know. I love this look. Very well done. All weekend long, girl. <laughs> so fire. Thank you. Thank you. Listen. Oh, my gosh. Your girl um, is going to need a water intermission because all yeah. the girls look so hot. Right. Ooh, we got sparkles We're gonna coming We're going to throw up. this to a break. Oh, we because are? Because we need water. It's hot. It's hot. The girls it are is hot. hot. The feeling is hot. Feels it's like getting in fuller here. and fuller in here by the minute. So we yes. like before it turns into chaos. We're going to take a pause, but we'll be right back. We'll be right back. So come back.
We are back. We had water. We feel refreshed. We feel refreshed. We're and back. an angel came to bless us with her presence. The woman, the myth, the legend, yes. MJ Day. Welcome. Oh, our, our there's someone else are also talking on, on microphone. Sound in here, you guys. This is chaos. So now everyone can hear the Queen speak in the building. How does it feel to be MJ Day? <laughs> um, it feels like we had a great night last night, and I slept three hours. So MJ's tired. We <laughs> no. struggled this morning. It was okay. it was worth it though. It was worth it. I'm so happy. I'm so happy to be here with you guys and having this really amazing night and another night and I just I don't know. It's it's such a great way to celebrate and kick off a year of really hard work that we've all put in and really just have a good time because it's been a while. Yeah. yeah. Do you find making the issue? there's a most stressful part of the process, like the booking the models, figuring out locations, trying to make it different every time, the launch, the events. Getting hundreds of thousands of swimsuits through customs. Yeah. <laughs> it's all it's all these things. I mean, luckily I have like an incredibly competent team that, you know, makes sure all of those things go really smoothly, but they are all stressful in their own ways because if one of those things falls off, the shoot can't happen properly, you know, and COVID makes things really hard. You know, we've been doing this through numerous surges and, you know, going to country, going to foreign countries this year was extremely, you know, exciting, but also it added another layer of stress and difficulty to what we were trying to do. So, yeah, I mean, it's, listen, it's, it's beautiful and glam and this is really fun, but there is like, there's a super heavy side to this that, you know, nobody really gets to see and paint. But I mean, you know, I definitely have lost some years off my life this year, <laughs> for sure, you know. But yeah, everything matters that we do. Like there's no kind of cushion built into all the things that need to occur to make a shoot or an event or the content go off. And so, yeah, I'm, we're never not stressed. My whole team will. Never not never stressed. stressed. Okay, so when the issue comes out, obviously the models are freaking out. Me as a rookie, I'm freaking out. Do you get anxiety every single time that a new issue comes out? Oh, it's the, it's the hardest time of my year. I get so much anxiety. I can't even function sometimes. I, like, I, I literally like disappear off the face of the earth, and the only people that see me or talk to me is really my team I just like it's all you can do to just prepare yourself mentally you know it's like it's like you're you're it's your art it's your craft it's people that you care about you're putting so much of yourself out into the world and you're also putting people that you care about into the world you know you guys as you know we are all very close relationships and we care so much about you and we want it to be well received and we want people to feel good about being a part of it so it's it's very very anxiety ridden time for sure um, I, I usually can't wait to get to this part because it's out it's out in the world now the conversations are being had we can exhale a little bit and you know you just celebrate all that you believe is good about it and that's what we're doing so but yeah a nervous wreck all of us you can ask any single person that's a part of this team and they're tell you the same thing that we are all like gonna need two weeks of decompression after this for sure yeah, for sure <laughs> it's break time afterwards yeah 1000%. Yeah. so one of the things that I find really unique about Sports Illustrated is the casting process and how for me we really sat down we spoke there was actually no getting in a bikini or showing my skin and it was really more hanging and talking how did you figure out your casting process or what do you see in women that really inspires you or gets you excited I mean, we, we cast for the person, you know, and you've been doing this for 10 years. Happy 10-year anniversary, Kate Bach. Um, and when we cast now 11 years ago, it was the same process that we've always had, and that is to get to know you and what you're about and who you are. And it really isn't about how you look in a swimsuit, really. It's, it's about who you are as a person and the type of energy you put into the world and you know what you're hoping to do and achieve and be and you know every single person that we meet is very very different and they're part of this for that reason because there's no cookie cutter you know 
image that we are looking to fill. It's about meeting someone, getting to know who they are, how they kind of set themselves apart, and, and really like try and prevent crossover because it's important for that. So anyway, for the casting process, we want to see that personality shine through and to really understand you know, who you are because we're also looking for a long-term relationship with you, as you can attest. And so it's somebody like, you know, I want to know who do I want to spend the next 10 years working with? And what are you like? And will I be able to do that with someone like you? So, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a very important process. It's probably the most critical part of the process because longevity is important to us and the person's insides are very important to us. I think that is really refreshing and unique, and that's what's been so special about Sports Illustrated is that that's not the case in many brands and situations, and as a model, that was such a unique opportunity, and it feels so special to actually bond with people and actually know they care about you and want to help you and push you, and I think it's reciprocated, so something I'm really grateful for. Yes. Yeah, I mean, it's like, it's, it's one of those things where we want you guys to become the biggest and best version of what you see your destiny being and we want to help you get there you know and it's it's important to understand what your goals are because we want to help you achieve those in whatever way that we can because we are such a big platform and because we do reach so many people and because we can serve as a connector in so many different ways so you know it, it's like really understanding like okay where is this person at in their life are they ready for like what we can do for them and like is this the right time? Because sometimes it's just not the right time. Sometimes you need another year or another two year or, you know, there's too much crossover with somebody else. And so you really want to get in there with people to, to identify that and to make sure it's a good fit for both of us, you know? The representation is important. And obviously SI is known for their inclusivity and everything. And it's so important. And we love to see that. But when it comes down to choosing a cover... How do you know? Like, I feel like it's one of those things when you know, you know, but like, are you ever on a shoot and you're like, this is going to be the cover? You know what's funny is that, and I said this to a lot of people internally this year too, like some years you have way more cover options than others. And this was one of these years. Every single, I could have done every, a cover for every single person in this issue this year. That's how great the photos turned out. And that's how exciting everybody was but you know there always is something that you know clicks when it's the eye contact or you know the lighting or the background even you know that makes it feel a little magical and there's a lot of stuff that can impact that that is without like it's out of our control you know what I mean like rain or you know somebody was like sick that day and you know what I mean so there's a lot of things that go into it, but like really overall, you look for a really strong, beautiful composition. And then for us, as we have evolved as a brand, we're looking to like tell stories, you know, across our covers and amplify that story. So that plays a that's that's a an, an evolution of this brand too. It used to be the best, only the best photo. It only mattered like what somebody felt was the best photo when they were looking at all the images. And now it's about beautiful imagery and the craft that goes into that and the person that's represented there. But it's also about the overarching story, you know, and conversation that can be held as well. So it's cool. I love that. It's a 360 deal here at SI Swim. Thank you so much. It's such a pleasure to have you. I mean, this is so cool to have this opportunity. I mean, Cammie and I only met in LA a few months ago yeah. because of Sports Illustrated and it's so cool to get to do this. So I think, I just want to say we're so grateful to you for all the opportunities and Beyond. just, you know, having us around and letting us do this is the greatest gift. Yes, truly. Uh, we, we both were, we're like, we love you. <laughs> do you love us? Well, I love you so much, but like, how cool is it for me to have like this moment with you guys, which is exactly what I want to make people very aware of, of just the multi-dimensional nature of how you guys exist and all the other things you do, can do, want to do, yes. other than, you know, in addition to be a model and, like, take beautiful photos. Like, you know, Kate, you're model first and then evolved into all of these other things, an entrepreneur, you're hosting, you're, you know, doing so many other things that, you know, you I've watched you 
evolve into as a part of this. And Cami, you know, you, you were like, you were a host first, and, and now you're a model. You know, it's just it's like a it's a really kind of important thing to note here. And I just love that these these are all the possibilities plus 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 that all of you guys are are doing and achieving. And I just think that's cool. Yeah, I love that we're ten years and first time standing yeah. in between together. You. <laughs> The queen, literally the queen, a true angel on earth. Thank you so much for everything that you're putting out into the world, everything that you're doing at SI Swim. It's not unnoticed. I mean, we have Pay With Change, we have Freedom On. Like, these are things that people need to see. So thank you. Amen. <laughs> Go get we yourself you. a drink. Yes. MJ deserves a drink, honey. All right. She's done a lot. <laughs> yeah. Good. Good. We love that. Thank you. No, she throws up the so you guys grow. I, I literally though, honestly, like how crazy is that when I think of like our little babies. babies. Literally like Oh, oh we're still we're live. Still live. But MJ still has so much to say. And she should be able and to never we ends. really should just give her the microphone. Welcome. Brooks. Miss Brooks. Miss Nader, What's how up? are we doing tonight? Hi Katie. What's up? Who do I do? Both of us. You can either. Okay, all right. Balance both of us right now. Okay, all right. <laughs> Done. Done. You look like a supermodel fresh out of the 90s. Every Ooh. day of your life. What is the secret? Um, I don't know. I just have a great stylist, which is me. Important. Yeah, it's important. Um, 90s is my vibe. Cindy Crawford. You know, that's what I always go for. Hair, makeup, everything. Same to you and you. Grazie. Oh, thank Love you. Thank Classic you, thank you. Glam. I was trying to give Jeannie in a bottle. <laughs> you are giving. You Good. Are giving Jasmine, Princess Jasmine. Good. Love. So, Brooksy, where did you shoot this year? I shot in Montenegro. Had you been there before? Um, never been to Montenegro. Hadn't been back to Europe in like a year with COVID. So, I was thrilled. It was amazing. It was your first journey abroad in a while? In like a year and a half. Yeah. You know how it is, girls. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I'm a first timer, so you guys have to tell me how it is. Oh. You look like you're a vet. I know she feels like a veteran. Veteran energy. Yes. Veteran yes. Energy. I'm trying to earn my stripes. So I'm earning my stripes. You're right. Thank you. Okay. What are you most excited about for the whole weekend? Um, well, Sierra performed, and that was a highlight already. I think yeah. I'm excited about hanging out with all the girls, all the As I Swim sisters, MJ team. Um, just being reunited. It's like a big family reunion. It's the best feeling. It I is. can imagine. This is my first time. I'm like, it's the best feeling in the world. <laughs> Welcome to the party. I feel like you probably had a fun adventure because you make anything fun. So what was your adventure in Montenegro? So my adventure day, I went to northern Montenegro, five hours away. And um, I went hiking. And it was the day before my shoot. So like there was a lot of risk with bruising and scraping. No injuries before shooting. Ooh, yeah, no. And you know I'm injury prone. So anyways, um, yeah, we were hiking and just like living off the land. It was very not me, but I loved it. Did you cook? Did you make a fire with sticks? Um, no, I didn't cook. I drank water out of the spring. The guide like dipped me down from my backpack and I like drank water. I can't. I actually think that's some of the freshest water there is out there. That's, it's gotta that's be. a gift, yeah. It is. That's why you're looking so radiant. Yes. Well, I'm, I'm glad you didn't have any injuries on your adventure day, but you may have sustained some on your shoot. Correct. Yeah. She what still happened? found a way to add an exciting moment. Yes. Yeah. On both days. Um, basically, I was on this very slippery rock, and we wanted to get me to the edge of it, which was like right by where the ocean dro do drops off, of course. And um, so I was laying there, and they wanted me to scoot closer, so I scooted closer, and I just busted, as you can see, it's on Instagram. Um, and I had a bunch of bum bruises, but it was the end of the day, oh. last shot, so it was all good. I just went home with a bunch of bruises, but it was great. Yeah. Every model that we've talked to is like anything for the, anything for the shot, anything yeah. for SI. I'll risk my life, yeah. I don't care. Yeah, we're athletes, we're sacrificing ourselves yes. out there. Extreme yeah. sports yeah. athletes. I love it. I love it. Okay. So we're going to let you go party. But before let you it leave, get started. 
we have to get into this look. What is this? Um, this is Bronx and Banco. Okay. Oh, oh my God, oh. I knew it. I was going to ask you. I knew it, I knew it. We knew. We knew. We're all wearing Aussie designers right now. Christopher Esper. Oh, wow. yeah. Bronx never fails. Yeah. They've never failed me, so I stick with what I know. Step into that energy, girl. Enjoy your Cheers. night. Love you, girls. We love you. <laughs> we continue to not touch you. anyone, yes. but we love them. We love them <laughs> from afar. Oh my God, there's little burgers <laughs> being passed around this Ooh. party now. It's getting started. Look who it's coming. Okay, this First might all, be the look of the look night. Look at this. Look, I mean, damn. Lorena, I have been saying this. You are unreal. Unreal. I mean, so not beautiful. Not everyone can pull this off. No, no. Okay, you, you, you shot in Montenegro. Yeah. How was it? Oh, my God. The city is amazing. I've never been before. So it's a magic place. So I remember the shooting in Montenegro. is the day of my birthday. So it's like a dream. It's the best present, you know? When's your birthday? Um, in 23 October. Yes! Oh my God, same. This is how I knew. And this is like the Scorpio outfit. This is yeah, the Scorpio. Can you tell us like, about this look a little bit? The uniform. Sexy and powerful woman, you know? It's very beautiful. Love it. Love it. What are you excited about for the weekend? So for me, it's super important to be here with the, fam the Scorpio straight family. It's such a dream. So I so happy. We love it. We love it. Do, Do you, you remember getting the call that you were in the issue this year? Was it, did you see it coming? Was it a special moment? Did your agent call you? Yeah, when my agent called me, it's, Lorena, you, this is your second year with the Sport Illustrated. This look. Did you Shout cry? out to Adam. Yes, uh, I feel like this magazine brings a lot of happy tears. There's a lot of happy tears that circulate here. Yes, uh, we love that. Support of uh, all of women in the world, so it's yes. super important for me to yes. be here. We're so happy to have you. Love it. And tú hablas español? Yo hablo un poco español. A ver, vamos a practicar español juntas. Por favor, <laughs> necesito practicar. But do you have a message in español for all of your fans, everyone who supports you? What do you want to say? Que hay que confiar en una misma y quererse mucho para poder querer al resto del mundo. Es muy importante creer en ti misma. All of that. Everything she said. It sounded great. <laughs> Thank you so yeah. much. You Enjoy look your night. Celebrate. Have fun. You look beautiful. I love this. I, yeah. I am bilingual. Girl can pull off a look. I already. <laughs> She's okay. something special. Who's next? Who do we got? Who is the Who next contestant on Sports Illustrated Swimsuit Launch 2022? Yes. <laughs> There's going to be an award. Really? At the end oh, touch yourself. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. It's a walk Come in. on. Come on. I love it. Haley Clausen, welcome to the party. You look so good. You guys look amazing. What was the inspo? I feel like you and Brooks are always giving 90s supermodel vibes. Yeah, that's always the inspo. Um, Honestly, I didn't plan any of my looks for this launch. I just brought a bunch of things and saw how I felt today. And Really? Because I saw you on the plane and you also look like a 90s supermodel. So together. naturally put together. I try to like have all my wardrobe go together and mix and match. And usually I'll rewear things and so it can all be reused. And yeah, It works. Yeah. So <laughs> where did you shoot this year? I shot in Barbados. And had you been there before? No, it was my first time going. It was beautiful. Yeah. Good weather, good. Did you go also visit Rihanna's I know house? We're like, did you go to Rihanna's house? I know, house? The whole, like when you hear Barbado, Barbados, you literally think of Rihanna. Yeah. No, I didn't see Rihanna. But it was beautiful. It was a beautiful place. Everybody was so nice. It was a really good vibe. I had good weather. I shot with Ben Watts, who's always fun. So, yeah. What did you do for your adventure day? I went off roading and go karts. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Let me tell you guys something about go karts. I got into a go karting accident recently and like scraped up my whole arm. I had a bruise. Did you say you got thing. in a go karting accident? Yes. It flew off the ground and came on top of me. It's a long story. Anyways, they're very dangerous. How did you feel <laughs> riding around in this go kart? Was it before or after your shoot? It was actually before. No it, bruises. 
It was pretty innocent, I would say. Like, it didn't feel too crazy. She I don't wasn't making it an F1 race. I was, I was going for gold or whatever you get at the end of a race. I was really going for it when I went. I was, like, ready to go for it, but they'd only let me go in such a big circle. But I actually don't drive. I don't have my license. Oh, my God. And they let you in a go-kart? Oh it was, like, a baby. It was, like, it was Black like a little baby one. No, you don't need a license for it. You don't? Oh, yeah. Children do it. Yeah. So... It was cool. I have so many so questions cool. about your driver's license. Why are we not getting our driver's license? So I moved to New York when I was 15. Oh, That's so it. The That's it. I would have gotten it. I never got it. But I have been back in L.A. for four years, so I kind of have no excuse. So well, the last the last two and a half didn't really count. We weren't going anywhere. It was COVID. True. 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 It would be nice to have that independence. So it's maybe like my next thing. Bucket maybe, list it. Maybe I'll get SI to document it. <laughs> we have to. We have to see Sponsor that. Sponsor driver's license. Yes. Oh, my God. It works the magic. Okay, so you've been modeling since you were how old? 13. What have you she learned was young. over these years? She started early. Um, well, now I'm 27, so I've literally grown up in the industry and had all different careers and comebacks and moments, so I've gone from like doing the runways at 15 to going through puberty in the industry to doing SI, doing fashion again, doing SI again, and kind of finding myself during that process and my other passions outside of modeling. What is the biggest takeaway? Um, well, my other passions and things that I'm working on are more behind the scenes now, so it's everything that I've learned, good and bad, from the industry, and it's the things that I want to change within yeah. it. So I've taken a lot away from that to hopefully make the change that I want to see. Yeah. Um, and then I've just been so lucky to travel the world, and I've made so many great friends, so it's been a really awesome experience. Yeah. And there's been hard times. It hasn't been all perfect, but all, overall, I feel very fortunate. Yeah. Oh, well, you look fortunate, girl. These nails, too. I know. People really brought the looks this trip. Love. Head to toe. Love. Why not? vibes. <laughs> so into it. And you did it yourself, which is even better. Talking with my hands. <laughs> well, thank, thank you so you. much for joining us. Have the best time. Enjoy your yeah. night. We're about to go. Right. With those boots. Thank you. Hey, love it. So good. We have She's Miss coming. Ducky. She is coming, honey. Lady She's in listening. Blue. The doll. Hi. The doll. Ducky the doll. How are you? I'm good, babe. How are you? You smell great. I just got like a waft of something lovely. What do we need? The smellatron or whatever yeah. it is. Yeah, we need the smell vision for you guys. You guys don't. You can't get all the the essences around here. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, Dior. Dior. This is Dior? Dior. Smells too. Oh, I was like, God. Dior. I was like, she got budget, it's honey. <laughs> you good. I love it. What is the dress? Tell us about the outfit. Um, do, you know, do you know, have you heard a poster go? They ended up making these really cool beaded, like, so this is, this is actually a top. So. Every time I, I try this stuff on, I have to do the top first. I'm gonna skip. But then I always have cool. to look it up on the website. Yeah. I don't know about you guys, but that's a problem. Um, but it goes down like this, and then it kind of opens at the back, so it gives it a little cute. Pretty. Running. You have to give a little sex appeal. You're going to glow all night. I love it. So Sickening. where did you shoot for your rookie shoot with SI? Oh my gosh, guys. I shot in... Montenegro. Have you been? Have you, have you? I have never been, but now hearing everybody talk about it, I feel like I have I to go like right I'm now. I'm really being sold on all the locations. Guys, this is guys. You. Guys. Montenegro. Is probably it? one of the most beautiful places I've ever. Sh Actually, yeah, the most beautiful place I've ever shot. Yeah. I didn't even. Well, hey, I didn't even know where it was. You yeah. know, so. I was, where is Montenegro? It's near Croatia. Right. It's That's like very limestone, said. sandstone island. Katie's good, you know. I didn't look this up before, yeah. <laughs> before I got here. But I had looked it up before, and I was looking at the pictures. like, oh, no way. It's not real. And yeah. I got there, and it fully looks like that. Yeah. Like, You're living in a postcard. Beautiful mountains, houses everywhere. 
boating. Nice hat. Regal. Stunning. Just, gi just giving Ooh, everything. Just like love the that. life I want to live. Paradise. Pure paradise. Okay. What was it like to find out that you were going to be a rookie this year? Well, I'm feeling a story is coming. I know she's like. She's so just what had happened us. was. Uh, yeah. I mean, I think sometimes like, of course I've always wanted to work with sports. Like that always had been on my list. I'm sure for you guys it was on your list for years before you guys had had worked with them. Um, I just didn't know if it was real or not. Do you know what I mean? It was like. Okay, I've heard, oh, maybe you might have a, a casting here a yeah. few years ago. I was like, I'll believe it when I have a flight and it's good. Right, yeah. right. Yeah. Truly. So I didn't want to psych myself out, but I um, have always loved sports women. I mean, the women are bomb. The pictures are phenomenal. And yeah. I think what sets aside sports illustrated models from, you know, the rest is... You really see like models' personalities shine through, yeah. and and that to me like sucks me in when I was a child, like all the way in Australia. So, this is a dream come true. I need a copy. <laughs> Your pictures look like a dream come true. You look so You're good. Gorgeous. Incredible. Yeah. Incredible. We're so happy to have you here. Welcome to the family. Welcome to the crew. Let's all go get a drink after. Yes. Look at that. Look at this. We actually met at the gym. We met at the gym. We had the same trainer. We do. We love Rob. We do. Gotham. Shout out to Gotham Gym, New York. Hey. Yeah, you're the SI OG. I'm actually so glad I got to share this space with you. Oh, thank you. The blueprint. She is the blueprint. Thank you, thank you. That's we'll party all night. We'll get a drink as soon as we're done. Yes. As soon as we're done. <laughs> OG, baby. <laughs> Thank you Thank so you much. Ducky. Have fun tonight. <laughs> See ya. Aha. Speaking of jo -Jo. iconic legends. Hey. Well, Josephine. First of all, this. No, first of all, what I need to know is that you just came back from Paris, like, yesterday? Yeah, I was in, I was in Cannes, just walking the carpet, uh, yesterday. Yes. I know. I was like, she's clearly in France. Like, she's not going to be yeah. here. And then she was there five minutes later. No, you've been Committed posting the photos cross. in France. And I've been thinking, she's not here. And then I look up and you're here. How are you functioning right now? You know, time travel is not so hard. Yeah. No, honestly, a few tequila shots and we're golden. Respect. Amen to that. Amen to that. Let's talk about this look. Yeah. Because you are the fashion girl. Vibe, you know, just like a little classy. Trying to. I'm trying to figure out my new, I just cut my hair Friday. Which I love yeah. the new hair. It's been like a week for me cutting my hair. So I'm trying to figure out my new style and like what I'm doing now with it. It's changed my whole wardrobe. Yeah. But well, maybe like it's fun to do a press event so that you do like a bunch of hair and makeup looks so you can oh, like practice. It's perfect. Like every yeah. day this week I've been to an event, so every day I've gotten to like play around with it. I find that I want to go a little bit crazier with my makeup because it's like less to do here, more to do here. Yeah. Oh, Are you so finding edgy, you're doing right. like phantom hair brushing? Like you just you think it's going to be there? Find, I, I went and did this a few times. I'm like, oh, no, never mind. You can't do that anymore. <laughs> so but I also love that you cut it after the wedding. Because I feel like a big haircut before oh. the wedding could be... I mean, I wasn't going to gamble. I've been wanting to cut it for a long time, but I was a 2020 COVID wedding baby, if I could call it that, and yeah. we had to postpone, like, twice. I mean, you had to do that as well, no? Yeah, we were on the same kind of, like, engagement timeline of it's very difficult to plan something in this Impossible. weird world. So now I find, like, it was over. I've been married for a month now. And I was like, you know what? Cut it. Congratulations, truly. The wedding, first of all, the wedding was like a production. So much happened. Miguel performed. You guys oh, got yeah. married. What was you got your married on a, part? a baseball field? Football. Football. You know, see, I know, I know a lot about sports. <laughs> and that's why I'm here. Um, okay, you were close. Incredible. Did you always want to have like a big wedding like that? Honestly, it got smaller than we originally planned. Uh, but yeah, no, for me, I never was a wedding type girl. 
but when you meet the right person and you just want to celebrate your love and like it was so magical having both of our families and everybody in the same place because I don't know if that's going to happen again ever in my life. Yeah. So I we just took it in and we made sure to stay. We stayed at the Hard Rock actually in Cabo uh, a few days longer with like 40, 40 of our friends and family and it just it, it made it so magical. So cool. As a bride to be, do you have any advice on anything that you are so glad you did? Wasn't worth it. Uh, don't sweat about the small things. Like literally, don't sweat so hard. much That's about so all hard. of them. <laughs> wedding favors, all the things. You're like, how small? How small is small? <laughs> no, for me, it really was the fact that like everybody's told me, take it in. Find a moment where you can just like be with each other and like take it in but and the biggest part don't let it go of each other the whole night spend together yeah. don't lose them because it's over so fast and I know it sounds so like trivial to say but it really is it's yeah. like it's your night and it's I don't know I just really tried to take it in and I think I really enjoyed it and still it was so fast yeah. you're like living on a high you have that glow going and then like prepare for the wedding blues the next day. It's weird. It's yeah. like it was such a come down. I was like, oh. Well, you're working on it for so long. Yeah. That's, I've heard yeah. that there's like a come down after the wedding. It's like a. I didn't realize until my husband called it out. He was like, hey, you okay? I'm like, oh, I think I got so the Are you blues. feeling sad? Yeah, because it's such a big moment. You prepare so much, and then when it's done, you're like, oh, guess I'll plan something else now. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm my God. I love it. I love it. Well, thank you. Yeah, we don't want to get you or jet lag going no. to a new level. We know. So let's all go enjoy ourselves a cocktail, perhaps yes. a coffee. Let's do it. Let's do it. And let's celebrate. Yes, ready. Thank you, Joe. It's time. <laughs> it's been a pleasure. Yes, it's been lovely. Thank you for letting us be your hostesses with the most assists. And We've thoroughly enjoyed this experience. Yes. It's really cool to get to learn about everybody's shoots because we don't really get to know about what anyone else did beforehand. Right. So it's actually really interesting to hear different perspectives and we're normally the ones that get interviewed. So yeah. this has been an enlightening experience and I've actually really loved learning a little bit more about every girl. Yes, and make sure you guys stay tuned to all of the things on social media. There's going to be so much going on for the entire weekend and you don't want to miss any of it. Yeah, we continue tomorrow and Sunday at yeah. the Hard Rock Hollywood. Come see us. We're going to keep it going. Keep it going. Thank you. <laughs>